Hi, I'm Rachel White with the Horizon League here with Milwaukee head baseball coach Scott Doffick. Just going to catch up with you a little bit here. Can you just start with uh, what have you been doing? How have you been spending your time the last couple months? Certainly been interesting. Um, you know, we are still actively recruiting. Obviously not being able to um, get off campus or really leave your house. It makes it a little bit tough, but uh, done a lot through um, uh, Skype and Zoom and all that and um, phone calls and texts and We've been able to, uh, you know, land a few guys and uh, certainly have, a, have had a lot of administrative type meetings um, pretty much every day and uh, just trying to stay safe and do our part. That's great. And how are you um, staying in touch with your team right now? Well, up until um, this week, we were in touch with them, you know, pretty much daily through texts or phone calls or um teams or zoom um, pretty much just making sure everybody's uh, staying safe and being well and trying to keep them on a path of productivity. And um, now that exams just finally finished, um, we will uh, kind of let them go do their thing a little bit here and figure out what's going on for summer ball. So we're trying to get all that set and um, go from there. Great. Is there a thing or a place you look forward to going or just something you look forward to doing when things are a little bit more normal again? Just as a person? Yeah. I mean, just being able to go out to dinner um, and walk around freely without any restriction. I think more than anything, you just don't realize what you're missing until it's gone. So I think it's those little things really that you miss. For sure. Um, you're obviously the chair of our league baseball coaches. I'm sure you've probably chatted with some of them during this time, but can you just kind of talk about how the focus of coaching has really shifted from what obviously you'd be normally doing right now, which is playing games? Yeah, right now we would be in day two of our of the conference tournament. Um, so that would have been an exciting time. Unfortunately, it's not. Um, I think all of us are trying to just figure out the new normal and then try to figure out the direction um, not only that our program is going to take, but the sport in general, there's so many question marks, um, and, and ideas out there that it's, a uh, it's a tricky time. And I think we're just trying to stay abreast of the, of the changing times and, and, uh, try to be as best prepared as we can to, to, um, you know, be ready to go when they say it's time and whatever that looks like. Sure. And why did you get into coaching? What is it that you love about this job? Well, I was a player, um, and uh, that's not anything new for most coaches. I think they all were, but um, I got out of professional baseball and wasn't exactly sure the direction I wanted to go, and uh, certainly loved the game. Um, and um, while I was playing, I had an opportunity to work with some younger up-and-coming players and um, realized how much I enjoyed not only participating in the sport, but actually being part of the, the growth of the sport. And so, um, you know, in the, in the first few years, I wasn't sure exactly what I was going to do. And um, it certainly became a passion. And I've been fortunate to be able to stay at one university for 25, 26 years, which is very rare nowadays. Um, and so to see the growth of our program and everything that that encompasses has just been really, really cool. That's awesome. All right, now we're going to do some more fun getting to know you type of questions. Okay. So the first one is, what's your favorite movie? Probably The Natural. If I go around a sports movie, for sure The Natural. Um, and that's old. Like, I'll talk to my team about it. They don't even know what that is, um, which is kind of disappointing. But it's kind of a hokey, feel-good story um, around baseball. Awesome. Do you have a favorite superhero? Favorite superhero? No, I don't think I do. If I had to choose one, I'd pick Superman because he really can do a little bit of everything. Utility knife, with all kinds of talent. <laughs> Love it. Um, favorite TV show to binge watch? Um, well, I'm old, so it was probably Seinfeld in years gone by, but I think uh, in recent days, We've kind of went in waves in, in the house here. In recent days, it's been the office. Awesome. Do you have a favorite food? Too many good ones to choose from. 
That's fair. That's problem. <laughs> um, do you have a favorite tradition that you do with your team? Favorite tradition? Um, I'm boring. No, I don't think I do. How about a how about a favorite like community service activity or something that you guys have done maybe over the years? Every single year we do we work with the Salvation Army and Toys for Tots, and so we do a couple different things. We you know we we're at the warehouse in bulk sorting toys. I mean there's millions of toys. Um, it's such a great cause. There's so many families and kids that don't have, and we take those things for granted. And then we're also able to walk families around and and help them shop for toys then and to see the kids light up it's it's just a pretty cool thing and our guys absolutely love it and so do the coaches that sounds really great well thank you so much for taking a couple minutes to chat with us and we look forward to talking to you again soon yeah everybody be safe <laughs>